Hi guys, it's your girl, the only money with the double KK. In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how I cook this mouth watering coconut jollof rice. Okay, before we start, let me quickly introduce to you the ingredients that I use. These are the seasonings, and there uh, I will be making use of coconut milk. Okay, and I'm making use of two. Then I'll be making use of tomatoes, onions, bell pepper, and scotch bonnet. So I'm making use of two cup of tomatoes. I'm just going to blend them. Now this is the meat that I will be using. I'm using turkey, chicken, and beef meat. Now I just transfer the meat inside the pot. I'm going to add in the seasonings. After adding, I'm going to mix it. Then cover it to steam before adding water i'm going to cover it to steam for 10 minutes on a lower heat so guys if you find this content useful please help me to share help me to like and drop your opinion in the comment section thank you so guys after 10 minutes this is it now i'm just going to add in water remember the stock water is what we are using to cook this coconut jollof rice so i added two cup of water then i'm going to stir then cover it to cook now i will be cooking on a higher heat and i'm cooking for another 10 minutes now i'm going to place a pot of iron leave it to dry then add in some flour oil so after leaving it to hot for some seconds i'm going to fry in the diced onions and two garlic balls now i'm going to stir fry then add in my pureed tomatoes okay after that i'm going to stir fry for like 10 seconds then i'm going to pour in my blend tomatoes bell pepper onions and scotch bonnet okay now i'm going to stir then cover it and lower my gas to medium heat okay so for it to steam for three minutes so after three minutes i'm going to add in the seasoning so this is all the seasoning that i used to cook the meat earlier okay then i added into stock cube making it five stock cube that we use okay now i'm still going to continue to stir fry then i'm going to cover it to steam for another three minutes so guys this is after three minutes i'm going to add in our coconut milk remember we are making use of two cup of this coconut milk then i add in my stock water please you know we are not going to use too much water to cook the meat okay so because we are adding in coconut milk as well now this is the rice i just covered these two to be cooking then this is the quantity of rice that i'm going to make use of now i'm going to add in salt and hot water to wash thoroughly so i'm going to wash three times so this is our coconut jollof stew as you can see it's not reddish because of the coconut milk we add it so in case you cook yours and you feel like oh my coconut jollof rice is not that red not that it's not going to be 100% red like the regular jollof rice. So I just pour in the uh, clean rice. Then I'm going to stir. Then cover it. Okay. Now, So guys, I will be cooking on medium heat. Okay. Now this is it. I was checking behind the scene. Now this is it. My jollof rice have gotten to the level that I really want. Okay. Now I'm going to add in onions i'm going to add in my mix our uh, bell pepper so to make it come out colorful i'm going to add the butter if you are using butter please at the beginning reduce the uh, sunflower oil that you will be using okay use little like i did now i'm going to stir and cover it then i will hide my gas to higher heat i'll be making use of higher heat so that my jollof can come out Bonds, okay my coconut jollof rice oh my, this really came out yummy i love it it's made like when you eat too much of jollof and you just want to try something new i will advise you to try this i think i will also be cooking this coconut jollof rice on my baby wire birthday 
part like for real i love the taste i love the outcome so this is it it's fully done i'm going to serve some for myself please guys don't watch this without helping me to share helping me to like and also drop in your opinion in the comment section for my old followers family here yeah, i appreciate you and i say a very big thank you and for those who are just jumping on my page for the first time please hit on the follow button and also subscribe to my youtube channel thank you so much for watching my content i appreciate you all and i say see you guys on my next video bye